Yo, what's up? It's your girl Riches, aka Callie. Eh. How are y'all? I know I ain't posted in a while. Oh, honey, I just been going through it. Sorry, I look a hot mess. I just came home from work and I danced this last weekend and it, I just swept my little pole wig out, y'all. It's okay. I'm, I got a hair appointment tomorrow, so she gonna do for this video, though. Uh huh. So as y'all can see from this subtitle below, we are finna talk about my new pleaser shoes that just came in. I got two pairs. Um, well, one pleasers I ordered about two weeks ago and I didn't like them. So I'm finna let y'all know why I didn't like them. And we're gonna talk about the new pleasers that I just got in um, today. First and foremost, I hope everybody is safe out there with this COVID. I know my family, they are in California. So they're still on lockdown. Um, I'm in Alabama. As of right now, we are fully open. We just have to wear masks everywhere we go. Um, I know Mississippi, a lot of other states is, is still open. But first and foremost, I hope everybody is out there staying safe. Okay, so let's get into my pleaser shoes that I got. It was about two, three weeks ago. I've wore them once and I don't like them. Um, yeah, I don't. I First, let me show y'all. These are them right here. They're seven inches. They're basic. I don't know why. I, they were clear, so I thought, okay, they're going to they gonna go with everything. That's what I thought. But this, I mean. This little plastic right here, okay, so I've learned the hacks, I've learned the tricks. Usually if you put a sock on, when you first get your shoes, if you put a sock on and you blow dry the top of the shoe as you're putting your foot in, it will mold to your feet. It will, it will mold to your feet. But that's not the issue with the shoe. I just wanted to throw that out there for some of y'all that had your shoes and be like, damn, they don't fit. No, you, a lot of, a lot of shoes, a lot of stripper shoes, the plastic does have to be melted. As y'all can hear it, it's a hard piece of plastic. For it being so thin, it's hard and it, and it has no stretch. So you gotta melt that down in order to put your feet in there. Now, I'm usually a size nine in women's normal, but your dance shoe, you always want to get a size above. So this is a 10. All my dance shoes, I get a 10. And that just gives my foot enough room. And it don't look big. Normally a size 10, you'd be like, yeah, she got some big feet. But no, you know, these you really can't tell. Now, let me tell y'all why I don't like these. They just not cute. I don't, I don't, I don't know. Like, they look very basic to me. And it's like... I don't know. I just, I, I don't want to give them, the shoe quality is great. It's just the style of the shoe. For me, it was real plain. And a lot of my outfits, you know, is boom colors in your face. So I felt like the shoe just didn't go, you know what I'm saying, with anything that I had. And that's just for me. Um, I have seen girls in um, shoe videos or reviews that, pull this shoe and they say they love it it goes with everything but for me honey it didn't work okay so <laughs> let me show y'all the new shoes that just came in <laughs> bow <laughs> do a little do a little shake my foot be in the air just <laughs> i'm joking i'm just okay and i'm i am gonna try them on so y'all can see this baby I think this 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 beautiful. I've I've seen girls wear these shoes. Sorry about that, y'all. My son walk in and I really don't want him on camera like that. So now it's my daughter. Hold on. My bad, y'all. They be doing too much. Lord Jesus, my daughter. Yeah, but yeah, I don't want my kids on camera. So, anyways, back to what I was saying. So I see girls wear these shoes all the time. I. I just think it adds just that extra like bam i'm in your face give me your money you know what i'm saying i feel like it gives that i'm fancy you know what i'm saying so okay so dang i don't know what i did with the box i will tell you what the style is all i know is i got them from pleasers.com um these were actually very very cheap they were only i think nine eighty five ninety dollars and i think it was on sale so now i see why it's on sale because it's basic but you know 
some people like basic I just I just compared it to I just felt like this stood out more than than this right here so these were I think it wasn't that much more than those I think these I think I paid 120 or it was like 110 plus tax shipping and all that plus I had it like two day ship because um, I was supposed to dance the weekend before last but um, we had a storm it was actually snowing out here so they closed the clubs down and everything like that so I paid extra for shipping and didn't even use them until last weekend but anyways so as you can see they have the little sparkle fringe I guess you want to say um I always thought it was they were hard I don't know like I thought like the little diamonds, I don't know if y'all could see. I thought the little diamonds was was gonna be hard. And I seen a video with a girl who I guess she was climbing a pole and the, the little piece right here hit her toe and her toe was bleeding. I'm on YouTube all the time, y'all. So as y'all watching me, I'll be watching y'all. So I don't I don't know what it is, but it is plastic underneath the diamond. Um and it does tie up in the back. Can y'all see that? It tie up in the back. So you can adjust it around your ankles because the you need ankle support just trust me and it's seven inches and it does have the plastic in the front it really does so i tried something different so when i ordered these shoes remember i told you these were a 10. it took a lot for me to mold this with the with the blow dryer i don't know i don't know just these just they was just lord geez, i'm mad I'm, at, I'm I'm probably finna sell these. So if anybody want these, they brand new, message me. I promise you, as y'all can see, they look good. No scratches, no a little, you know. Message me. I sell these thirty dollars. Hit me up. Look, anyways, so I always try to make some money. Okay, so I got a size eleven in these, and the only reason I got a size eleven because they didn't have a ten, and I wanted the shoe so bad. So in my mind, I'm like. Well, hell, I wear a 9 and I get a 10 and 10, you know, fit me exactly on point. Like, literally exactly on point. No toe hangs over, but no heel hang off. So, it, like, it just fit perfect on my foot. So, I'm like, if I get an 11, it shouldn't be, you know what I'm saying, that much bigger. And as I suspected, it wasn't that much bigger. This 11 actually fits me like a, 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 a 10 and a half in, in stripper size shoes. You know what I'm saying? So, it actually, and I'm going to show you, it actually ain't. It ain't that bad. So let me, I'm going to go ahead and put these on. Y'all don't mind the background. I just did laundry. I got, I told y'all this is my laundry room, everything room, everything room. So um, my daughter took my little beanbag chair. So I'm sitting on just a little lawn fold out chair. So let me scoot back so y'all can see me putting on the shoe, me standing up and all that other stuff. So. Why that didn't help? Ha! I'm gonna get my life together, y'all. I promise you. But I'm gonna go ahead and try them on, and then I'm gonna stand up. And I, I think my camera, I can see it. You probably can see over here. So let me go ahead and put uh, them on. See how easily they they popped in, and I didn't even have to. That was fresh out the box. I didn't even have to mold them. Nothing. So I give myself extra brownie points. You know what I'm saying? For that oh this one I gotta tie the back because I untied them and they do zip on the side so you unzip them get all the little fringe Lord out the way see then you just pop your foot in zip I'm gonna go ahead and tighten. Y'all can see I'm tightening the strings. I know what well, y'all really can't see. Damn. I'm gonna get better, y'all. I promise. I promise. I'm gonna get better. I just gotta decorate this room and, you know, get it looking nice. Some of y'all YouTubers really go all out, and I'm trying to go all out. So, here we go. Let me move this damn chair. There y'all go. Y'all see those? Y'all see those? Let me see. Y'all see how they just, they just friends, you know, look, just walking across the stage and you just, you know, 
They just feel good. They feel, they feel real good. And I know y'all really can't see. I told y'all I'm gonna get it together, but they just cute. They sturdy, you know what I'm saying? So they look good. And they draw attention to your feet. See, they draw attention to your feet. They just so, they just so cute, so cute, so, so, so cute. So, that is that, but I just wanted to, you know, so show y'all my review. I think these shoes are amazing. Just for my little pink shirt, black pants, looking like I'm ready, you know what I'm saying, about something else, but most important, they're comfortable. They're real comfortable. So, let me see. Boom, boom. I'm gonna do a video, y'all, with, I've been, I've been saying it for the longest, but I'm gonna do a video. Damn, let a bitch sit down first. All right. I'm gonna do a video on little poetry trips I know how to do. I've been talking about I'm gonna do it forever, but I'm tired. <laughs> So, and I need to start uploading more. I promise y'all, I want to take y'all in my life so bad. I just be out having fun. You know what I'm saying? You only live once. So, I try to make sure I grind hard enough to where my kids ain't got to get it out the mud. You know what I'm saying? So, that's why I do what I do. Because at the end of the day, <laughs> I'm going to be a millionaire, baby. Trust me. I got my company shirt on. Fitzpatrick's Professional Services. I do taxes and all all states so if y'all need to tax it don't hit me up i'm also a real estate agent i have my own property management company fitzpatrick's realty you can find both of, both of them on facebook i buy houses and rent them out and sometimes i buy houses and flip them so a little always try to put a little promotion out there free promotion hey, hey. all right so y'all let me know what y'all think um the next video like i said i'm probably going to do I'm trying to think I've been dancing so spare lately like and I'm just being on oh, house piece of tape I don't know what the hell that was um I've been dancing so spare sp like spaced out I just been having a lot going on um I really been focusing on my business business more um and I've decided I think I'm only gonna dance more than likely probably this year maybe half of next year and then after that I'm just gonna I'm going to just let it be done because I'm making enough money. If y'all watch my previous videos on what I'm trying to do, I'm close. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm actually almost there. I'm just greedy. So, I'm just, you know, really want to see what I can really pull out. Um, what else? That's pretty much about it, y'all. I'm trying to think what else. Oh, shout out to all my people on Instagram and YouTube. Y'all been, um, well, people from YouTube been seeing me. And I'm up to like 78 subscribers, which I think is pretty cool. Get me up to a thousand, y'all, so y'all can't see more of me. Um, what else? Y'all write me on Instagram, the real Cali period. I answer all my DMs. A lot of y'all been asking me questions on like where, you know what I'm saying, I think y'all should go to or, you know, what states and, you know, just a lot of good stuff. And keep it coming because I answer everything. And even if y'all negative, I see... <laughs> I see some of y'all hating hoes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> y'all keep commenting too, because I'm a okay replying. Uh -huh. But other than that, you know, whatever y'all want to know, just ask me. So, <sighs> my kids, they they eight and four. <laughs> no, I'm joking. I love them little babies. They just fight. I got a boy and girl, so they fight a lot. Um, but um, what was I going to say? The next video, y'all, the next time, y'all probably going to see me. Um, to be honest with you, either tomorrow, today's Wednesday, I really want to audition, um, in Birmingham, Alabama. Um, there's a club out there called Club Volcano that I'm thinking about auditioning. And on Thursdays, you got to go audition. Same as Mississippi, you know what I'm saying? On amateur night. Um, I just want to rotate a little bit. So I know I'm going to go probably either tomorrow or next Thursday and audition out there and I want to take y'all along for that so expect that video coming up and then um, I also um, 
There's a club out there called Blue, um, well, not in Birmingham, it's in Atlanta. It's called Blue Flame. Um, I've been watching them on Instagram for a minute, and uh, I told y'all before, I think Atlanta strippers, they go, oh my God, they, they come with it. They come with it, but I've been seeing some dancers on Instagram, you know what I'm saying, that have my vibe, have my style, because like I said, I don't be doing all that bucking and, you know, I just sit in the, you know, I don't, I don't you know, I, don't, I, I just, you know, I'm tired, so, you know, I'm, I'm slow, you know what I'm saying, so I've been seeing a lot of girls on Instagram, you know, um, the club just looks small, I don't know. If you're a dancer and you from Blue Flame, comment below. Let me know how, what's the vibe like, shit. Let me know before I drive. I told you I'd give myself a four-hour limit to go anywhere in Atlanta from where I'm at. It's four hours. So, I'm trying to come fuck with y'all. <laughs> Let a big bitch come fuck with y'all. So, you know, if you dance and you from Atlanta, comment below um, and let me know. I noticed this one girl on Instagram, uh, Stripper Life of Brie. I follow her. She, she with the shit. She also... Uh, does uh stripper boot camp so i think that was pretty cool so i know she dances at a club in atlanta i just don't know which one but brie girl if you, if you ever watch me ha, get that money bitch um but other than that that's pretty much about it again i love y'all 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 keep me y'all keep me going y'all y'all keep me pumped so let me know what more y'all want to see um another video coming out i'm gonna have more liposuction in april so, um, next video I do, I'm actually, um, another video after I do, I'm going to post that whole surgery. Y'all seen my BBL surgery. I still got a little leftover belly fat, so I need to go ahead and go get that snatched up. So, what else? That's pretty much about it. But as always, y'all comment, y'all subscribe, y'all follow me on Instagram, Instagram, The Real Kelly, period, <laughs> period. And, you know, show your girl some love. And I promise, I always follow back. Because at the end of the day, we all got that crown. You feel me? I right. Well, it was good. I, I was going to say seeing y'all. Y'all see how nervous I begin? Lord Jesus. Y'all hit me up. All right? Bye.